Right, how to play uh, Amazing Grace on harmonica by ear. So if I was to tell you how I'm playing it, then you wouldn't be playing it by ear. But what I can do is play it as you go along, right? Come on. So, so hopefully this is before you found a tab before this is before you've gone that far you match this is the process of playing by ear I'll give you a clue. I'm blowing notes to get to the note of the first, the first note of the song. Again. Again. Let's go back. You may even be able to see what I'm doing. But if you have never played this song before, following a tab or a lesson, right? Just by taking the time of trying to work out what I'm doing without me telling you what hole, you know, I've done that thing where I've, I'm, I'm counting in my head almost. Well, I'm not really, because I'm going up and I'm listening to da, da, da. But even though I'm playing it over and over and you're watching me, right, I'm not giving you the tab. I'm not telling you what hole it is, but I'm giving you clues. But although I'm giving you clues, you're still having to rely upon your senses. You're developing some an eye for stuff and an ear for stuff. <laughs> So I think that's all I'm going to give you. But look. That's the whole song. And if you watch what I'm doing, here's another clue. I'm staying around. Not really purposely, that's where the song is leading. That's what the song is demanding. I'm sorry, I'm staying around a, a small amount of holes. I'm not going... No. So another clue is I'm staying around a, a, a small area of holes. So I don't want to go too far because when you're starting stuff, do it in bite, 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 bite size chunks. Get the first note, get the second note. You can, you can get this tab. You can get this tab easy, done. 
you you just read the tab, do it, listen to the song maybe, follow the tab, memorize the tab. You know, like I watched a video earlier of somebody who was improvising and he done a lick, then improv, lick, improv, lick, improv. And I was able to break down, these are blues licks, I was able to break down what he was doing. It's like, wow, and then copy what, he, just copy what he was doing. <laughs> Something like that. I was able to go, right, oh, he's doing that. And then I went, Or some, and or I would go. No, no, it's not that. You know, I would, I would. You, you're going along a path. What's right? Write it down. What's wrong? You go. No. Well, I'm not going to do that again. Do that three or four times over. That's the whole song. Because all you're doing, that sort of song, Amazing Grace, you're repeating verses. Once you've done one verse, you've done all the verses. Play that four times over. You've got the song. Write, find a note that's right. Write it down. Write, the, find the next note. Write them down. I put a, a if 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 a song was oh, you notice that a number a few things were blow blow draw draw blow blow draw for instance. Then I'd put a two above each the number where there's two. If there's no number above it, then it, it's just one hit. That was blow, blow, blow. No number above it, but some songs require free. Free, a free above it. Free hits on, on the four. So I put a three above that four to tell me it's free hit. This goes in a, in a booklet, and I'm um, uh, then, you know, in six months I've done seven songs, for instance, um, just just for instance, and now I've got a book with seven songs are in, and I can play those songs off by heart. Uh, this will go towards doing this. Will go towards right. then able once I could do some bending I was then able to pick out the notes for that no tabs no lesson just picking them out using the blue scale you know play learn to play the blue scale first learn to play them notes and then pick out those notes of the song write that down it's a lower octave anyway I think that's enough to get you started <laughs>